satisfied over to our refreshment center for the most extravagant array of refreshment goodies ever assembled under one roof. Enjoy breathtaking, mouth-watering goodies. Everything from a snack to a delicious whole meal. At our refreshment center, you'll find a large variety of goodies to satisfy your hunger, your thirst, or your sweet tooth. So hurry, hurry, hurry. Visit our refreshment center now. The show starts in 10 minutes. Show starts in eight minutes. What up, SJF? How you doing? We're going to get started in a few minutes, people. Live with Chris Holowicki and Polly Pocket, who is uh, waiting on the main stage. Oh, wait, here she comes. <laughs> How are y'all motherfuckers doing tonight? How about you toss us a like? <laughs> Excuse me. We're gonna get started in just a few guys. The show starts in five minutes. 
people are saying things. Can't you walk with your phone on, Chris? Can't you watch YouTube while you walk the streets? Well, I don't have dogs. You gotta go for walks. Can't be walking places. I live half a block from the 7-Eleven. I've never walked there in my friggin' life. Always drive. Four minutes. Just about ready, motherfuckers. Butter. Tell you what, the show starts in one minute, not two minutes. the show starts in one minute and somebody leaves. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. What's up, motherfuckers? Welcome to Loot Crate Live. And now, <laughs> we have even less people. We had six. We had six for a long time, and now that we're actually doing it, Try we have three. <laughs> okay. Um, how y'all, how y'all motherfuckers doing today? Oh wait, you can see the chat pretty good here on the second device. Travis, where's the South Park Green Street stream stream at? We're doing this, we're doing this right now. <laughs> Everyone, say hi to my special guest, Polly Pocket. All three of you? Hey. What happened to half of you? All right, there we go. Back to four. Polly Pocket fans. I have two writers <laughs> and butters. Sorry, you got to take a hike. She is smoking. Yeah, I don't want to get it. Cayete, go. Go away. All right, so we're uh, doing fucking Loot Crate unboxing. I have currently... <laughs> um, currently, I have uh, three, three boxes. Uh totaling in $75 worth of loot crate that I'm sitting on right now that I have not opened. They just keep showing up every month and I haven't been fucking looking at them. Um, yeah. But uh, this is one that just came in the mail today. Neighbor Bay actually dropped this off on my door. We were going to shoot a loot crate video anyway, but 
Apparently this one came in the mail today. And, uh, all right, just want to say that this, uh, this episode of Loot Crate Live is brought to you by Bud Light with Lyme Disease. Cheers. Okay, so this is the newest Loot Crate. I have no idea what the theme is. I think we just should get the new and improved Loot Crate opening utensil. And, um, there's barely any delay on this. On my, on my, uh, PlayStation streams... There's a big ass fucking delay. I'm watching yeah, the live like stream in this, and it's like, yeah. Doing like, oh yeah, maybe there is a little bit of delay. There's a anyway. super big delay. Well, this. uh... <laughs> Do you want me to? Travis is seeing if I give the loot boxes a lucky kiss. You know what? I'm not touching my mouth to one of these fucking things. Um, let's let's open up. Did he was asking me if I was gonna kiss the loot box all right anyway um oh the new loot crate knife is surprisingly more effective than the than our past ones this is a black metal machete as they say um yeah this thing i shouldn't be machete. playing with this machete. <laughs> oh! okay um let's put machete. this somewhere that Put your couch that, chair. that chair is dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Build your own atomic laboratory in minutes. The Loot Crate Lab, another handy career building kit from Loot Crate. All right, what do we got in here? Okay, it's uh, looks like science, science fair festival. They look like they're having fun. Yeah, exciting she's got science. pigtails too. Look at that. There you go. Connections. Mm -hmm. Let me get dry on that. Is this dead? It's no, I don't want that. Like, um, I'm not supposed to be smoking. Fuck I'm you. not supposed to be smoking. Fuck you and your I have life. Smoke. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, <laughs> first things first. I pull out this little motherfucker. What is this? It says, uh, little sister, little sister vinyl figure. And it looks like. What the fuck is this? What is she holding? What'd you say? There you go. What Here. do you think she's holding in there? Oh, it's from Bioshock. So this is probably some kind of... It looks like whatever she's holding is pointy. Oh, it looks like it probably injects something in you. Little Sister Vinyl. Can I open it? Try not to damage the friggin' box. Why not? <laughs> because I'm gonna sell these things. Because I have a whole box of Loot Crate shit that I was gonna go to a garage sale, but it was too early in the morning to do, so I didn't do it, so Dude, I still I'll have the box. Some cash it, what? Fun fact, you look on eBay, there is no Loot Crate item that is worth more than $5. Little girl. Like... This is actually kind of neat. I played through maybe like the first quarter and a half of the first Bioshock and I got stuck and I just stopped playing. But there's some cool stuff about oh, that she's game. Real cute. Yeah, that's a neat figure. It reminds me of my daughter. Does it? Yeah. You know what? Mm -hmm. Let's get it in here. It's a Luxie. Look you ever feel at like that. following Air the Wolf and watch her animations. She makes cartoons. Wow. But they're dark. And cartoons. <laughs> so. Damn, that thing's pointy. Do you want this? I have no... It's not yeah. part of any fandom I have. That's all yours, Polly. Yeah. I think it's cool. I think it's neat looking. But you may have it. <laughs> yeah. Um. Totally. Is this one of the ones that you... Did you pop the thing and it makes All right, it... we're not doing... Wait, well, you didn't want that though? Well, oh, I thought it was. All right, here, just take it away from me. That's not from me. <laughs> All right, next up, we got a motherfucking t-shirt. What is a t-shirt about? Oh, I was hoping that this is going to say glow in the dark, but it says Loot Crate exclusive, which doesn't mean much. There's millions of these out there. What is this? It's like another fucking shirt. What is this? What is this? It looks kind of familiar. Oh, Westworld? I don't watch that. I don't watch that HBO show. I still have to get into Game of Thrones. I love this design, though. I wish it was for something I like. You know what I should do? Just it like my Teespring. Me of Alien. Yeah, kind. Of, yeah, it's sort. Of, yeah, it reminds me a lot of designs like from Marvel Comics. Actually, like uh, there's this teleporting guy. I think his name is the Sentry. Kind of reminds me of that design. This looks kind of comic booky to me. 
But you know what I should do is I should just take this design, slap a Drunken Atheist Studio logo over it, and then sell it as original art on my Teespring store. So we're going to look into that. Fuck HBO. I have HBO Go, though. It's a fine service. Nope. Rules still stand, Dan. Um, let's see here. Okay, loot button. It's a button of like a beaker with toxic waste. It says, screw your lab safety. I want superpowers. What is that for? It's just a, it's just a thing. I'm not wearing this loot crate. What's in the box? They just give you a black box with nothing on it. What do you think is in it? <laughs> um, yeah, I'm sure that Loot Crate uh, just mailed me a, a dildo. Let's go here. What's in the black box? Can you guys hear us okay? I'm not mic'd up today because... Oh, cool. This is pretty neat. But see, I don't keep... I don't keep, uh, I don't keep stuff to, I don't cool. keep dishes. I don't have any silverware here. I don't have, well, I do have some plates up in a real high shelf, yeah. but I don't keep plates or bowls or silverware. Nothing that needs to be washed. Everything is disposable. But this. You're lazy as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> this, I, uh, will probably never drink out of. So that, um, Las Palos. oh, this got this like sturdy ass, like plastic straw to it. Yeah. I'll probably just, you know, I'm a Breaking Bad, I'm a Breaking Bad fan. This is pretty neat. I mean, it's not practical though. I mean, It'll it has this screw on cold. top. Actually, those keep your cold drinks. Really? Fucking cold, yeah. You put ice in like a silver. Do not shit. microwave cold liquids Dude, don't only. don't fucking microwave that shit. BPA free. Warning, do Set not microwave. Made in China. It doesn't say anything on the box. I don't know what BPA free. Non toxic. It's oh, like so it's better to drink out of? For vegans or something. Yeah. <laughs> you know, because they're not allowed to drink out of vegans. Not they're not allowed to. BPA. You can't drink out of plastic. Mm. No, no paper towels. Um, and other vegan things. Facts. <laughs> Yeah, stuff like that. <laughs> no paper towel. <laughs> okay, it doesn't say anything on the box, which I, I'm sure we'll learn more about this uh, Los Polos it Hermando Hermanos like Los Polos Hermanos. In the middle of a taco shell. Yeah. Do you have you seen Breaking Bad? Do you watch that show? Never. Have. All right. This is a restaurant that exists, and it's a spoof off of the restaurant El Polo. Loco, which is only like in California. I mean, man, I should keep that just for like fun. Yeah, it's something. Yeah, you could like keep your beer. In. Yeah, I could. I could put my beer in it. Exactly. See, so we're brainstorming. Oh my god. You have no hands. You dropped your toy. Okay. Up next is. Look at this. It's my boy Spider Man. Um, I love Spider Man. He's like on a couple of my walls. What are we? What is it though? What is it? What's in the bag? What's in the spider bag? Oh, just a couple of pictures of Spider Man. Mm. Neat. 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 Venom. Neat. You know, I could pick up if you go to like Michael's or uh, Hobby Lobby. Probably. I don't think they even have Hobby Lobbies anymore. No, they have Hobby Lobbies still. I mean, like, very few. There's one on Roosevelt. Oh, so fuck, we're doxing. You tricked me into doxing our location. Um, okay, um, um, all right. Come find us. For, like, 20 bucks, I can get four frames with the glass and everything, and I can put these guys in, and I'm like, I, I like the artwork. The goblin's a little... It's good. It's good. It's these are cool. I wouldn't be against putting these in a, you know, little frames. You know, the black ones venom. Yeah, the black ones venom. The red ones 
carnage. That's neat. I like these. Travis, you've told me about realistic Spider-Man. It's like your favorite fucking thing. I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> what's next? Um, what's this shit? What the fuck is this? Oh, Turn yeah. dinner stress into dinner time. Sixty dollar gift card, twenty dollar off your first three deliveries plus shipping. Ah, uh, it's tricky. They, they, you gotta spend money, save money. Hold on, what is it? Hold on, let me. Hello Fresh. Oh. This is not nerd related at all. This is something that people on podcasts try to sell me all the time, but I people No, I, I can't I can't I can't order seen hello from yeah. high school from here. Here you can take like, a look. I can't scheme bullshit. No, 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 no. Hello Fresh is like they deliver you the ingredients and you can cook it at home and they deliver you precise ingredients. And it oh my gosh, they tricked me into doing a fucking ad read for them. Really? They're not paying me. This is not a paid ad. I'd rather not. No, 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 like Blue Apron, have you so heard of that? Trust some motherfucker to actually do the right thing and like... It's a good service, they're, they're yeah, popular services. Half the time delivery people don't fucking need to do But it's right all pizza. delivered in like dried ice and all this stuff. It's it's good, It's they're good services from what I hear. I'm it sounds just, good for me. I mean, for 60 bucks, like fuck them, I'm just going to go grocery shopping. Like, no, it's not... <laughs> it's like, it's, it's so that you don't, but see, it's for people like me specifically who I'm going to buy something. Oh, let's say I want to make something. I'm going to throw out most of the stuff because I'm not. Fans want a tour of my tattoos and I'm. Listen, no, no, no. Listen, listen to what I'm saying real quick. All right. It's for people like me. Like, let's say I want to make um, You're anything. You're a lazy bastard and you don't want to go out. All right. There. No, that's not what it's about. It gives you precise ingredients of measurements of the spice you need. So you, I'm not buying like. You need to buy a whole pack of flour or something like that. But it just sends you what you need. Fine print. All right, we're when this is not a Hello Fresh debate. You gotta get a fucking membership. Yeah, I know. I know all about that. It's every podcast uh, you know advertises what? Hello like Fresh. All right, here's membership. the thing about the fucking uh, all right, cup. All right. Bucket, bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of buckets, how about buckets of chicken? We're on. We're gonna see what this cup's all about. That was a good segue, right? High five for myself. <laughs> hey, give me a high five for what I just said. <sighs> okay. Um, the old ways are still the best ways of Los Polos. It's totally like good chicken. One taste and you'll know. As fans of Breaking Bad learn, something delicious is really the uh, owner's ghost for a secret running in Ninja. Shipping out illegal in that They don't say anything about the fucking cup. Doesn't say, there's nothing special about it. Just a plastic cup with a, with a sturdy straw. Just a cup. That's okay. I'm happy they brought Loot Creek Mag Loot Creek Loot Creek Loot Crate magazine back for me not to read. Yeah, what a fucking Loot Crate. Yeah, what do I do with all this? You know what I do with all this? Where's that? My chate. I telegraphed it now. You think it's oh! sharp enough? Kill a loot crate? Absolutely. No, dude, you gotta fucking, like, hack that shit in half, like, in the air. Do, like, a... I think I've tried doing that. All I'm gonna do is, like... <laughs> like... Well, I almost took out the box lamp, but I think I think the teeth put a little bit of damage in. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, I, I did I did I hit it with this side. Well, I, I was expecting it to get stuck I'm in the thing. I'm actually going to see what kind of damage that was. You want to check it out? I, we got to rate this shit. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. No, I want you to fucking... So we got seven people watching right I now. I want you to hit this. No, 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 no. I did we, 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 I shouldn't, I shouldn't... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got it. Let me see. You karate chop this shit. No, 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 let me see. I'm not, I'm doing, not going to try to hit it out of your hands. Are you what out of your you doing, mind? Man? That's that I would chop your fucking arm off. Uh, to put a little bit of damage into it. I don't know. That, that's like so. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, you just watch <laughs> right through my leg. <laughs> all right, all right. Hold, hold up. Um, no, it's too. It's too. <laughs> I'm worried about Polly's safety now. Well, maybe you should be. Um, 
Well, we got seven people watching right now. Let's leave it up to the people watching. Should we open up one of the other little crates I got here, guys? What do you think? What do you say, huh? What do you say, huh? We gotta wait. They're on the delay. I bet they're gonna say no. They're gonna say no in the stream. Just be pricks. Goddamn. Maybe. God damn it. I shouldn't. It's like a bat. It's not sharp. This part isn't sharp. These teeth are sharp. You don't need to go do that. See, you just. <laughs> it's fine. I'm not going to fucking hit a box out of your hand. No, I was missing. Where'd you find that one? Oh, I tossed it over. You can retrieve it. Same fucking box. All right. So if that thing's really. We're gonna. I have two more loot crate boxes. Do you guys want us to open another one? It was going to be a one-box stream. But we'll keep going. What are you going to do? No! I'm not hitting that while you're holding it. <laughs> crazy. What are you, crazy? You crazy? Yeah. <laughs> Tasia, will you please pick one of those boxes over there? There you go. Not calling me Polly. I mean... Polly. by my Russian name. Fuck you. <laughs> Top or bottom? <laughs> you going by weight? This is, feels very lightweight, actually. All right, but let's let's let's, let's cut it open. Pack that fucking shit, man. You gotta do it now. No way. Yeah, Michael Myers, that shit. Yeah, you want me to just like stab through my legs? Jason, fuck that. You want me to ruin all this like... <laughs> merch? All right, I just broke the seal. We're moving on to fifty dollars worth of loot crate merchandise. I don't even remember what they fucking gave me in the box that I just opened. Besides the things I could see, that Hello Fresh advertisement, this stupid cup. Do you guys think that was worth 25 bucks? Probably not. All right, on to the next $25 worth of loot crate. It's okay. It's okay. It's on my new pants. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this must have been the October box. Loot crate presents a cavalcade of cur cursed creatures. This looks like the creature from the Black Lagoon. And this says the, the beast from beneath the waves. So it's obviously a... You can cut that out and make a mask. Yeah, fuck yeah. Look at that, guys. We can make a mask. Where the fuck's your scissors? Yeah, They're around. <laughs> I, you know... Here. I don't really want to make this mask. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Turn it oh, off. Oh, Jesus. All right, fuck it. Fuck it. Give me that fucking thing. No, I have scissors. I have real scissors. Get your fucking... All right, fine. I'm going to get scissors. You're not gonna use a machete to cut out the fucking Halloween mask. That's a good start. Safety kitty scissors. Good. Careful. Ah! Um, pocket is not loud. Sure, brother. Name is hell. Then you can't cut a Halloween mask with no machete. Anyway, um, improvise. <laughs> All right, we got a shirt right up the top. Oh, I see something that I think I'm gonna like. I'm wearing this fucking mask, man. All right, this is. Attack on Titan. That's some anime shit, yo. That ain't cool. It probably is cool, but I don't watch it. I probably still wear this shirt if I'm out of shirts. What is it? Attack on Titan. It's kind of it's a cool design. Again, it's a cool design, just not something that I watch. Not something that I watch.
Yeah. It looks like something from Hellraiser. At first, I thought it was like uh, Hellraiser, like a guy with no skin trying to find a, new skin. Sure, you pass up at the Goodwill and when you're rack, like surfing through the racks of shirts. Well, I don't think it's. I don't think there's anything wrong with the shirt. It's just not. It's not my fan. Uh oh. Oh shit. Hey, dude, how Shirts on the camera. People can't see us no more. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> how, many, how many people do you think would be a fan of that? Attack that type is supposed to be cool. I just never seen it before. Is this such a is it? Oh no, that's it. What did I do with the box? Oh. Here we go. Evil Dead 2. It's one of my favorite movies of all time. Next yeah. to Evil Dead 1. It actually came in a movie? No, this is a like a just some kind of it's called Super Emo Friends. So it's kind of a lame thing, but they've licensed Evil Dead too. I have a couple of these other super emo things. So let me grab one. Dude, are you crazy? Your fucking leg is right under that. <laughs> Do no, not, do not. I'm not retarded. I know I'm not going to stab myself in the fucking leg, man. That's <laughs> racist. You're not supposed to say retarded. Chill the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, this is one that is, uh, what are they, emo, super oh, emo I friends? Oh, I my leg. No, you, you <laughs> went, you went you. like this as I was walking up to you. Um, all right, this is a super emo friend. I mean, it's kind of cute, it's kind of cool, but also kind of stupid. It's like, Why? Why? I just don't get it. It's like a, it's like a take on a pop figure, like a third string idea way to make things more cutesy to sell at the mall, at the Spencer's Gifts, at the Hot Topic. Right. Let's see what this thing's about though, because I love Evil Dead. That's so sad that Ash vs. Evil Dead is no longer being made no more. You scared the shit out of me. You, I thought you were some kind of swap monster. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> yeah? Look at the camera. You're going to spook them guys. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Let's put this fucking thing together. See, it's like... They could make it, like... I don't know. I'm just not a huge fan of what these people do. Um... I mean, I'm not against things being cutesy or whatever, but I'm just like, this is kind of stupid. But uh, this, I'm really liking that they have. Uh, does this snap in? Or what? My well, bitch, come on. Oh, uh, God. Ash is like, it's like their whole thing is like they're making the, the, the character in question is crying. This doesn't even attach. This does not even attach. Oh, wait, 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 maybe it does. Okay, okay. Yeah, that makes more sense. All right, cool. All right. There we go. He's crying. They could have done a little more work on uh, this character. It doesn't look quite right. I mean, it's I like it. I mean, I just like looking at it. I just think it's fun to see. I'm looking at it through the camera right now. I think it's fun to just see this guy. The boomstick and the fucking chainsaw. This is pretty neat. I don't got any room for any shit like this anymore. It's like all the shelves are taken up, so this will get piled somewhere next to something else. Hmm. You're getting used to this mess, aren't you? Yeah. It's not so bad. You can kind of see. See out of it. You can kind of see out of it. If you cut the eyes more proper, you'd be uh, doing more better. I know. I tried like this. Like What's this. next? Oh, gizmo socks. I'll wear these once, and then they'll be 
lost in a laundry cycle for months. And then I'll wear them again, probably. And you'll lose the other one, and then you wear And then eventually, I'll, I'll like, have... one sock. Because I have a tendency to, like, instead of going to do laundry, I'll just go out and buy more clothes. I'll just go buy more socks. So then you end up with, like, 300 pairs of socks. And then one day, you're just like, dude... I'm going to throw out all these fucking socks. You must be rich. <laughs> no, it's, it's, no. It's just five bucks. Never mind. I don't need to explain this. <laughs> what is this? American Horror Story? I don't watch that. Bad, bad item, Luke Crate. Never really, Do you watch American I, Horror Story? Never really got it. I watched the first episode of the first season. And then I was so fucking too drunk and hosting too many apartment complex parties. Okay. That nobody could ever focus on that. I wonder if this is like a key. Like, what is this thing? It, they, there's a key in there, but can you take that to like the hardware store and get it made into a key you for your fucking car? Or your freaking house? For your front room? Um, <laughs> Apparently she was in starting like a whole season or some shit. Please service room. Is it a door hanger? It's not a door hanger. You can't fit a friggin' knob. You can't fit a friggin' knob through there. I don't understand what it's supposed to be. This is one of those things I'm, I'm gonna try to sell. I'll clean my fucking room. And I'll put this on my, on my door. This is one of those things that nobody's going to buy. Oh, this is kind of... Oh, I actually like this button. Uh, Ouija board. Ouija board. Uh, loop crate button. You don't want to mess with that. Ouija boards? Are you afraid of Ouija boards? Mm, probably don't want to mess with that kind of shit. <laughs> I'm not scared of no Ouija board. Okay. I'll eat a Ouija board. Okay. I eat... I eat Pieces of Ouija board for breakfast. And guess what? Good news. What's that? It's another fucking mask on the inside of the box. So we got a two for one on masks. Uh, what's in this loot crate fucking magazine? Ouija. Ouija play scent pen. Attack on Titan shirt. Exclusive Super Mocha Scenes, Evil Dead 2 Diorama. Is there even like, is there proliferation along those lines? Or are you just tearing around it? Because you're doing a pretty good job for the. Never mind, you continue. Do what you're doing. And I was right, this was for October. Who would have thunk that all of this Halloween y stuff would be in October? I could have gotten Gizmo or Gremlin socks. I'm glad I got. The gizmo, I suppose. Okay, what's up with this fucking key? American Horror Story keychain. This is a fucking... Where is that fucking thing? This is supposed to be a keychain? Who the fuck is carrying this around? It's got a fucking tassel on it. That's gonna get disgusting on, like, day four. And it's got a big ass key you don't need on it. Like, yeah, where are my fucking keys? Lady Gaga fans are gonna fucking love the shit out of anything. They're, they're like, she has so much to do. Okay, where are my fucking keys? I don't know where I put them. There's already, there's too many keys. There's no reason I'm gonna fucking hook on an enlarged key that's not even real on all my freaking keys. Don't you want any keys? Keys. You, you, you're hunting for keys? Oh, it, it doesn't matter. You know, that sucks. Alright, we got six people here still. And we have one more loot crate box. What do we say? Do we open the next loot crate box? Do I blow? Do I blow? This is a 70. This video cost me 70. If I open that loot crate box, this video has already cost me 50 bucks to make. 
I opened that one. This video cost me $75 to I make. still have like $120 in my ass crack from working earlier at the strip club. <laughs> so fuck you and get over yourself. <laughs> It's just, no, this is, it's definitely not <laughs> worth the investment. Alright, what is this, Ant-Man or some green dude? No, it's a Halloween mask, some kind of bug monster. It kind of does look like a superhero face, though, doesn't it? Let me see. Let me, let me just see it. Hold on. You're damaging it. I'm trying to put on damaging it. Yeah, you are. You just bent it in half trying to stab through it. Yeah, you know we're going to feed it. Okay. Zero okay. It's, That's when you know I'm drunk. Okay. It's, it's just like, I mean, you just Polly, and you're just like, <laughs> All right, now we only got five people. We only got five people now. Oh, yeah. wait, it says we have six down there. It says we have five up there. all fucking annoyed with my... Animal. Oh, drop down to five on both of them. Are we going to open this next box or what? I think we need six people for this to be a $75 freaking video. There we go. She's got a new mask on. Psychically, I'm talking to whoever left the stream. Come on back now. Come on back now. Why are we... Hmm? Are we worried about them? Well, I don't know. I'm just talking shit. It's not like we're not going to get views eventually. Oh, yeah. We'll just leave that thumbnail up. Hey, what did y'all think of that thumbnail? Thumbs up? <laughs> Never mind. I don't need to know your opinion on the thumbnail. <laughs> oh, I kind of do. Yeah, I guess I don't need to just protect you from these degenerate scum. Oh. <laughs> no, they know that they, 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 they are, they are, they are uh, practices of degenerate behavior. Not all. Hashtag not all. There's a lot of, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of um, good actors out there. So are we 50 bucks? Do you think I got 50 bucks worth of shit out of these two boxes? Would you say, oh yeah, 50 bucks? No. Hell no. I would say... 23. I think the whole thing is like a rip-off system. A rip-off system? The last system. one that we did a long time ago was... It was fucking shit garbage. You just get shirts and fucking keychains. <laughs> you, <can go> you can go buy whatever the fuck shirt and keychain you want. Mm -hmm. You don't need to be in a $25 a month service. No. All right, we're going to open up another box, I think. <laughs> the machete A just slices straight through the packaging. Two erect thumbs up. That's what the thumbnail gets. Very good. See, that was tasteful. That Aww. was very tasteful, Dan. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, God. See, they gotta take like alien. something cool shit like Evil Dead and Alien, and then they gotta make it lame as fuck with making it all cutesy and stupid. Like enough is enough with some of this stuff. Like, I mean, I guess it's okay, but I'm so there's everywhere. And just give me something cool. Give me an alien figure that's fucking gross and scary. But. Wait, oh, and this is the other thing. Why do they have to make it so, like, pornographic sounding on the outside? This is an adult collectible. An adult collectible. It's adult collectible. This looks like there's a toy. It looks like a toy of me. No, it's not a toy. It's an adult collectible. 17 plus. What's in here? What's in this box? What kind of perverse things are in this box? This just looks like a toy. This looks like it's okay for kids, but no, it's... Adult collectible. Open the adult collectible. I feel like they're sending these to kids. Five bucks says there's a freaking pocket pussy. Probably just an anal butt plug. <laughs> That's probably what they're sending the kids. From 
from the shape of it. Jeez. Here we go. A little spider up your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, put a spider up your asshole, man. Like, <laughs> see, it's just like this, like just this stripped down design. It takes away everything that's cool about the xenomorph, and just it's left with this like. So Funny joke. What if an alien and what if the face huggers were like little dogs? I mean, I don't think that's that clever. I think that these people at these like what are the what are the websites called like T Fury or whatever? I don't like that. Um, a T Fury and stuff. Oh, <laughs> this bitch broke. This bitch broke instantaneously this is not the first time this is not the second time this is a multiple times that this has happened where i'm putting together these fucking things and they just snap apart in your hands i guess that's why it's an adult collectible because it's so cheap that if it was in a child's possession for even a moment this is designed this is designed horribly what were they thinking they were just thinking, like, oh, we'll totally rip this dude off for $25 a month. That's about it. Dog shit, Loot Crate. <laughs> oh. All right, what's next? I like it. It looks cool. It looks like a death metal shirt, it's but I know shirt. it's not. What is... I like the color scheme, too. Again, oh! Total chick shirt. Is it? Venom. No, it's Venom. Okay, I couldn't read it because I'm so close. That's not the first time I had it. This is bad fucking ass. This is bad fucking ass. Yes. All right. All right. I'd say that we're 20 in. There are 20 bucks in of stuff that I actually want to possess. Um, this is a cool shirt, though. I love the design. If you look at my Teespring store and all my shirts, uh, this is definitely of my um, up my alley. This is definitely up my my alley of uh, the yeah, colors. Like, I love the colors. I have the purples. I love this like pinkish know, red here. I have to disagree with your last T-shirt design. Wait, oh, because you want me to Photoshop faces onto the Slumber Party Massacre one? Yeah, your face should have been in that dude's face. At least yeah, but then that face. makes me look like uh, I, 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 like I murder women. I thought that over. That was one of the things. I'm just like, yeah, I don't want to come off as someone who kills women with a guitar that has a drill on Not the end like of it. Not like you're American Psycho and you will be Christy like type shit. It's just like. Okay. Uh, fucking photo bad. All right. I see your criticism. We got a cool loot crate button. It's a face hugger. I don't know. Did an alien movie come out this month? Because uh, it's pretty neat. It's from Alien Covenant. Alien Covenant came out a long ass time ago. So I don't even know what month this is from. This is all alien invaders. Oh, it's an alien themed box. Uh, yeah, so Venom t-shirt. Alien next door artist series figure that breaks in your hand. Predator jungle camo bandana. All right, here's an yeah, X-Files hardcover journal right here. That's pretty neat, I guess. Yeah, yeah. put the bandana on. It's another notebook. Loot Crate is Loot Crate is big on handing me out notebooks. I have so many empty notebooks that Loot Crate has sent me. I just last one I opened was a goddamn. It doesn't say Predator you anything on You gotta put on it on like Rambo. What Hold the fuck are the you fuck doing? Hold the fuck up. Hold up. Do you guys see what I'm holding here? This is something you go to Joanne's Fabrics and you say, I'll take a slice of this. What this has on it is a Predator, a fucking Predator um, t 
tag on it, and this would probably sell at a store for like what? They'd probably sell it for like sixteen dollars or something. Holy fucking shit! No, but you. This is what Loot Crate is mailing me now. This might They're mailing be me pieces of fabric and saying, the, "Oh, it's like Predator." The one fabric that actually only does the job when it comes to being weird, like. <laughs> Okay, no, they fucked that up. Alright, no, they didn't. Shut up. Set it on. <laughs> it's pulling my hair. Alright. Now, now you're Rambo. I do look really cool in this. Like, uh, I do look really fucking cool in this like, bandana. You know that? I'm gonna start walking around like this. This is really gonna add to my. This is gonna be my new thing. Oh, and plus. That's uh, <laughs> a little excessive. <laughs> a little excessive. There we go. This is my new look, guys. But, you know, any other fabric besides... I look like a fucking the terror. The Predator fabric. The specific fabric that the Predator people picked out. This is just a... This is just a... This is a napkin. They mailed me a napkin and they, put, and they stapled a uh, friggin'... Uh, predator so price tag I on nailed, it. Nailed you a napkin that you put on your forehead. Yeah. Yeah, you fucking would. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so I got this bandana now. This isn't really how I wear bandanas, though. This is how. Um. Now you gotta do it like rainbow style, yeah. Uh, Oh, it's no. Like, oh, like you're about to go. No, I'm gangster as fuck. Fucking kill a bunch of people <laughs> with my bare hands. <laughs> like, cut it off. Careful about my eyes and face. Good God, Rambo. <laughs> there we go. All right, yeah, I'm gonna. I'll wear it like this. <laughs> I'm not I'm not repping no crips or bloods. No club colors. No club colors. <laughs> no biker gang colors. All right, so this is this is this cost me seventy five dollars. I'm an overweight old lady. Who said that? Somebody just commented. <laughs> You know, it's really funny. I I actually went up to somebody and I... I don't see that. That's from a long time ago. Oh, one of the mods might have taken it down. Uh, or you might be seeing things. <laughs> no, she said something about... Her old don't worry about day. it. Fuck them. Um, Not worried because I, I swear like if, if um, you know, 120 pounds is overweight for my 5'1 frame, I... Tasia weighs even less than I do, guys. I would be like, concerned <laughs> for somebody that weighs less than... Somebody actually told me, I was like, hi, I'm Polly Pocket. I was doing my thing at the bar, my dancer job, and they're like... Oh, no, you're not. This one dude is like, oh, no, you're not Polly Pocket. I know Polly Pocket. I'm, And she's, like, almost seven foot tall, and she's <laughs> way skinnier. And I was like... <laughs> Well, he must have been fucking no, with you. what I said Seven her, foot no, tall woman like, who's way skinnier than... Serious. And I was like, dude, what is she? Seven feet tall? Straight out of fucking Auschwitz or some shit? Like, are you starving the girl or some shit? I'm like... Dude, that's not cool. I'm like, if you got, if you're like that tall and you're skinnier than me, you got some fucking health problems. All right. And you need to get help. Okay. All right. <laughs> but good like, story. Good story. No. Let's let's pause it there though. The funny thing, he came back to me. Later oh shit. In the night and like threw twenty bucks at me. It was like, I'm sorry, you are Polly Pocket. Blah 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 blah. I was like, okay. I'm like, dude, All right. like, I need your reassurance. Hey. Good story. Fucking bullshit. We did it. <laughs> we did what? We did the story. 
And we are at 55 minutes right now. We've almost gone for a full hour. How's everybody doing in the chat? Does everyone, what do you guys think of the new headgear? Is that, this is going to be an everyday thing for me? I really actually like the way it looks. <laughs> you look like a bum from Malibu. A bum from Malibu. Is that what you said or is that what somebody in there said? Somebody in there. I don't see what you're seeing. Oh, there we go. Travis, of course. Sad. Really sad. Oh, the bag is supposed to be pretty uh, disappointing. Uh, I heard that it was like... Uh, Dude, I wouldn't know. I went to the movie theater drunk. And you were there? You went and saw it? I tried. That's one of the few movies I skipped. It's so funny. Like... I went there, drunker than shit, and I watched the beginning of it, and I was all excited to see this, like, huge shark and everything. <laughs> and, and like, I passed the fuck out drunk. And then my friends didn't wake me up until the very end of it when there was no shark to be seen. No, so you missed all sharks? I missed everything. Oh, God. And, then, and like, they're like, oh, well, first of all, they're like, oh, there's something happening or there's something here. There's a big thing, whatever. And I was like, oh, great, I get to see it soon. Well, they knock the fuck out. And then, and then I wake up and then they're all like, in the movie, they're like, oh, it's good we never have to see that again. Like, I was like, what the fuck did they see? Like, I never get to see shit. I fucking, um, like, I passed out. Missed the fuck Let's out. Let's think about movies I passed out in. Don't drink in movies. When I worked Don't at, um, drink in movies. when I worked at AMC, I went and, oh, well, I fell asleep during, okay, here's the big one. Oh, I passed out during 300 Rise of an Empire because I was working overnights at a Denny's, so I was tired and passing out in movies in the middle of the day. But I passed out because I was drinking all day. I saw a 7 o'clock showing of, or maybe, yeah, I think it was a 7 o'clock showing of The Force Awakens. No, 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 not The Force Awakens. The Last Jedi, the last big Star Wars movie. Where did you get that cigarette? Over there. That's mine. Crafty motherfucker. Um, <laughs> but, um... Oh, yeah, I passed out during The Last Jedi, halfway through, and then I had to go see a matinee screening of it the next day. It was Fucking, and then I, it sucked. It sucked. And I, it, it, it was infuriating. I'll be right back. Where the fuck are you going? And he left me by my lonesome. Um... Oh, shit. Are not as fuck. Polly, short chicks are not as fuck. Did you mean but then he said hot. Yeah, he corrected himself. Probably hot. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird because we could watch either. We could watch either one. We are watching the stream how it actually looks and how it looks to us. That fucking blanket's been in the shot this entire time. God damn it. Yeah, you could you could like clean your apartment then. I just put I just did clean the apartment, you see. <laughs> Still <Even> there. More. <laughs> there we go. But I've got Snooky. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like a little white girl. <laughs> you call me little white. <laughs> um, actually, I just got off work at the strip club that I work at, and yeah, yeah, I might look kind of tired. Thanks. Who said you look tired? He's like, are you just waking up or are you carrying on from yesterday? Oh, I was wondering who he was talking to. You know, what I did before this, or before every, all right, so my schedule today, or yesterday, was Friday night. All right. That's a long thing. 
<laughs> no, I go to work at the salon. I cut hair until 9 p.m. And then I have to race to the fucking strip club and work there until 2 a.m. And then I gotta go fucking here. Gotta I, come here. Like, gotta come here. <laughs> yeah. You gotta do what I gotta do. This is professional. I'm running a YouTube channel. I'm sporting new high fashion. Travis, you won't. Travis, come on. <laughs> you don't really know. I mean, you're... All right, so we have hit, we've surpassed one hour. We did it. We opened up $75 with a loot crate. We hung out with you motherfuckers. And uh, yeah, I think we I think we're I think we've done done it. You're Rambo now. Yeah. We're we're good. And um <laughs> thanks for coming everybody. Make sure to like and subscribe. Hit that bong for notifications because who knows before I to pa before I pass out I might do a, a ga a game stream. And also, um, yeah, check out the Teespring store and the fucking, uh, you don't need to check out the Patreon. But thanks for everyone who does, all four of you. You guys are cool as fuck because you chucked in a buck. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Love you all. Thanks for Polly, Polly Pocket for showing up <laughs> and uh, guest starring. Thank you, Polly fans. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, well, I'm out of Loot Crate boxes now, so maybe around Christmas time, do another episode of Loot Crate Live. Bye, motherfuckers.